Hi Alan, I'm sorry for taking a long time for this one, but I'm kind of busy in this time of years. Uh, today I finished my application and I promised. Uh, last time I crawled in the application from from your company, uh, my application will be most bus connection for your PC, but as we know, <coughs> we cannot connect to the Mothbus device, I don't know why. So today I make a different application. I will try to introduce you a little bit about this, this uh, application. Here we have your POC. This, uh, this one is T16S2T and this one is USB 4750. Uh, this, this one will connect to your POC through this wiring and which will get all the data from the input and output from your PLC and transfers to my laptop via this USB cable. Okay, this one is used for this software. This is a simulation software in 3D view. The great thing of this software is it can affect I mean, it can run like in real time. Uh, I will show you. Here we have two convenient. One is entry convenient and one is exit convenient. This convenient will be run or stop by the startup of your output, your PLC output, the creating is it can affect it immediately. Same to the sensor. If the sensor is affected, the input in your PLC will come to one. Okay, now I will try to run the system. Here we have an electric spark with two buttons, start button, stop button, stop button and reset button. Here we have the switch to select auto mode and manual mode. Now I try to change this to auto mode. Run this software. Here we go. When I change this switch to auto mode, as you see, the speed on your VLC, on your VLC will come to one. Okay, now I try to run the system by pressing on star button. The first convenience is running, and the other one's running too. Now take a look on your PLC. And you see the input and outputs will be changed and start up from 0 to 1 and 1 to 0. It will be affected by the simulation software on my laptop. Okay, now I will turn off my camera phone and show you more detail on my laptop. Here we go. I try to stop the system by pressing on. Oh, make a mess. Stop the system. Can choose manual to auto. Okay. And start this again. Use your program.
this wiring to your PLC X0 for the item entry this is a sensor this one is for the item exit this is a sensor to you see this is the wiring hardware on your PLC On this demo, I try to use your PLC in a simulation system and it's running very great. So I hope you and your boss will love this uh, application. Now I will try to stop the system by press on the stop button. Stop it. Okay, and try to run this again by press on start it. Stop it again, change to manual mode, and try to start. You see, when I turn it to manual mode, the auto bit here will come to zero. And if I try to start the system, You see, it doesn't work. Okay, try to automate again and run the system. Okay, this is my application. I hope you and your bot will.